Make a date with Reverend Dr. Ebenezer Markwe at 6 a.m. from Monday to Saturday on Graphic Online via Facebook and YouTube as he expounds on matters of faith. Graphic Online, truth and accuracy every day. This is Reverend Dr. Ebenezer Malkwe of Living Streams International. We meet behind the trade fair behind Zenith College, bringing you matters of faith with Graphic Online. This morning, I'd like to caption my, my, my topic with uh, the, this, the, the heading, 10 chapters. I find a very funny story in, in Genesis chapter 24. Genesis chapter 24 is one of the famous marriage uh, chapters in, in scripture. Um, where Isaac, uh, Eliza, Abraham's servant, goes to find a wife for um, Isaac. But in Genesis chapter 24, verse, verse 67, there is a very powerful and pregnant word over there, or, or scripture over there. Eliza goes to find a wife for Isaac and then brings Rebekah to Abraham and to Isaac. And the Bible says, after the introduction and all the gymnastics that takes place, I mean, the Bible then made a statement that was very interesting or intriguing to me. He said, and Isaac took Rebekah, his wife, to his mother's tent. Isaac took Rebekah, his wife, to his mother's tent. And that, I mean, freaked me out. Now, that's, that's a new woman coming. That's a new woman coming into, into the household. And then I thought that, right, now that they, they are married, there's something that Isaac needed to do. And if the Bible says, therefore shall a man uh, leave his father and mother and shall cleave to his wife, and they twins shall become one. Now, all of a sudden, Isaac marries and then takes Rebekah into his mother's tent. And for me, that's where the, the powerful truth is. You know what that means? Behave like my mother, talk like my mother, speak like my mother. So that Isaac was boxing Rebekah. And sometimes, many times, what we do is that we box people when we demand for people to act like other people. So Isaac taking Rebekah to his mother's tent, it's, it's a new beginning, it's a new chapter, it's a new marriage. And they needed a new setup, a new, a new situation, and everything new. But Isaac takes Rebekah to an old situation. And therefore, think like my mother, do everything like my mother. And of course, the mother's paraphernalia will be all over the place. And so, I mean, Rebecca is going to be staring at the mother's uh, uh, things and this and that. It belongs to Isaac's mother. It doesn't belong to her. So guess what? Many times we try to box people and force people to act in a particular way. We define how they should act. We define what they should be. And many times in marriages, you'll be very, very surprised that people want replicas of their fathers or replicas of their mothers. Everybody has have their own identity. And we must al allow people to express themselves and be themselves and not be somebody else. You can't wear source armor and go to fight Goliath with it and win the battle. You, you, it, it, it doesn't work that way. You can't move. And that is the problem of many things. Sometimes men look for pictures of their mother in their spouses. And women also look for pictures of their fathers in, 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 their, in their husbands. No, 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 no. Everybody is an individual and everybody is different. And we must learn to appreciate people. Yes, there are character qualities we need to look for. And there are character qualities that are important. But those are internal things. But the external, that is Rebecca's tent, the external is where the issue is. Trying to force people to become other people and defining what others should be. And it's your own definition. And forcing them to walk according to it. Leave people alone and let them be themselves. It is the best. You can't take me to your tent and open your tent chapter for me. And you can't do that. It is very, very important. And the chapter of marriage in your life, it's yours and your husband. Or your, yours and your, and your wife's. And learn to give them a fresh chapter. Don't take them into somebody else's chapter. See you next time.